For nearly 200 years, San Francisco de Assis Church has stood at the heart of the cultural and spiritual lives of Taos. It's a masterpiece of vernacular architecture and, not surprisingly, has attracted the attention of thousands of artists over the last century. In fact, it's reputed to be the most often painted and photographed religious structure in the U.S. The early Taos painters were captivated by the church, among them Ernest Blumenschein, who painted his church at Rancho de Taos in 1917. Oscar Burninghouse's church at Ranchos was done in 1920. World-famous artists have painted it, John Marin in 1930, and Georgia O'Keeffe the same year. As O'Keeffe said, most artists who spend any time in Taos have to paint it. I suppose just as they have to paint a self-portrait. I had to paint it, the back of it several times, the front once, I finally painted a part of the back, thinking that with that piece of the back, I said all I needed to say about the church. French photographer Bernard Plassou called it a visual hymn to the Southwest, the cathedral of the American desert. As the light changes in the course of a day and bounces off the mica-speckled adobe plaster, its very aura seems to change. Harold Joe Waldrum's Primrose Light 1972 shows some of that light, as does Fritz Scholder's darkly brooding 1979 Ranchos Church. Every day one sees them there, amateurs and professionals, painters and photographers, striving to capture a unique view of the beauty and grandeur of the church, joining the endless parade of artists enchanted by San Francisco de Assis.